Yeah. All right, so I wanted to let everybody know, all these new parents, how much diaper garbage you're gonna get after 11 days. Okay, so we had a newborn, 11 days. We've been using the Ubi stainless steel garbage pail. The way it works, it's got this locking system for kids. We rarely use that part. But this is whew, what keeps the smells in. And then to rip, take it off, we lift this. So this, we're gonna just weigh this really quick. But let's just tie this up. Now, very important, do not use plastic bags from the grocery store unless you want a big mess, potentially a leaky mess. Worst, a smelly leaky mess. So again, these two bags, let's weigh it so you get an idea. So I'm just going to try and make basically like a little hole. These bags should not tear even if I do this. So let's just do this and let's see if it holds them up. Okay, it's gonna be a little tricky. So let's just do one by one. So this one, we are at four, almost five pounds, or is that kg? That's pounds. And then this one, Did a hole. This one is a little more. So seven and a half plus four and a half. So 12 pounds worth of diapers in uh, 11 days. And this does not include the diaper weight. This diaper weighs 18 grams. Say we went through maybe 10 a day. So that's 100 diapers, 100 diapers times 1.8. That's 1.8 kilogram, which is about three pounds. Okay, fine. So maybe seven and a half pounds of actual, um, you know, urine and, and whatnot. I definitely recommend this Ubi. Um, it comes in, with these bags, I'm gonna just load this up since I already did it. Uh, again, no mess because this is all metal. And of course, stainless steel keeps odor way better than any plastic container. So these garbage bags, you get, I mean, they're a little pricey, obviously compared to free bags, but they are as strong as contractor bags. So that's kind of like why I, I guess I would say so far so good, nothing's torn. And uh, there it is. That's it. You can also get those on the go. Anyways, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Oh man.